My name is Dr. Mike Datola. I'm the owner of Valley Dental Aesthetics. We are here today getting trained on our new Glidewell.io system, which we're super excited about. And so one of the things that can be problematic in trainings, because I've done trainings like this before, and it's if you don't push people, attendees who are reluctant to do it themselves, because that's really the only way the information gets stored in your brain. And he was very good about gently pushing things into people's hands and making sure that everybody got the experience to at least give them enough confidence to start this process and do more. It's pretty simple and straightforward. It's just basically contacts and occlusion. That's it. Contacts and occlusion is all you have to do. Um, I didn't expect that. You know, from, from back in the old days, you know, working with other chairside CAD CAM, you literally had to design everything, almost the whole tooth. And so it's clear that the AI has made a huge leap forward and is proposing crowns now that are anatomically correct. And all you have to do is play with the contacts and occlusion and you're done. very confident about delegating a lot of this to my staff is that really is kind of what it comes down to and that's why a lot of people don't get involved because they don't trust um, maybe don't trust their staff to be able to do this and be able to come up with permanent restorations and so yeah I'm very confident in what I saw my staff just be able to do uh, for the very first step their very first time having the mouse in their hand being able to use this you know a lot of the tools are somewhat similar to what I've used before and back in the days of doing CEREC but uh, I think there's a lot, uh, lot more built into the system now to where it's, uh, it's more, a little more intuitive. I feel pretty confident. Um, he is a great instructor and um, he makes it really clear to pick up and understand. So I'm looking forward to getting started. The design work was easier than I expected. I'm excited to be able to get my hands on and do it in the office here. So when I do the first uh, initial test Bruxer mill, uh, I do show the staff the crown and usually they're just blown away by how you know pretty it looks. A lot of the reaction is, uh, is this polished? And I say, uh, I didn't do anything to it. Uh, that's just straight out of the mill. You're just gonna have to see a sample. Whether you're at a show or wherever you are, go by and see what it looks like right when it comes out of the mill and have your mind blown. And then you will believe all I need to do is polish this and I can be a chair side cat can dentist.